get into the pro the really identifying a problem. And I love that you started yeah. there and then you think through what's a process that, and a, a part of the problem is, is, is you don't have time to go through this process with a thousand people. Maybe you could do it with a dozen, but as you be, look at scaling some of the things you're doing in ministry, you need to automate, automate some processes, but do that in the most personal way. And so having a system like this really helps you to personalize their experience based on, you know, kind of their decision-making tree. And so I, I think about, you know, for online church of somebody that accepted Christ, you know, and so somebody accepts Christ, well, then you send them kind of maybe a sequence of emails that takes them to landing pages that says, join a group or become a member. Um, or, or I think about it, a first time visitor to your church. And so if somebody fills out a, hey, I'm, I'm going to visit your church this weekend and you give them information, then you send them a follow up of how was your experience? And with that, it takes you to a landing page with a video with more information, with different things, and you personalize that follow-up that comes with it. And so I, th I think as you begin to think through whatever size church you are, there's an opportunity to personalize some follow-up in an automated way. Uh, and I think we just, we just kind of say, well, we, we just want to do everything traditionally. We want to do face-to-face or we want to do phone calls uh, yeah. and certain things. And I think that's great, but I think there's a point where it doesn't scale very effectively. Yeah. And you can, and, and I think what, what really does not scale effectively is your, is your pastor. Uh, the pastor can only make so many personal, personal touches. And so you and I, Jay, can help our pastors in many ways by helping them have a personal touch in, in a, in a, in a automated or in a digital way uh, with things like welcome videos, follow up videos, videos that communicate small groups, discipleship, what's important to your church. And so really thinking through with the technology like ClickFunnels that automates some things, it's a lot of front end work, but it's very scalable and it's very, but it's, but it's also, you can adjust it very quickly too. So when you find things that aren't working within your funnel, you can adapt it quickly and make adjustments. So I think it's a good long-term investment. 